Introducing Square Kicker Presets, the fastest way to make custom changes to your Squarespace website. Presets are used when you have created a unique style with Square Kicker that you want to apply multiple times across your site. If you're familiar with CSS classes, Square Kicker applies the same logic with presets. To create a preset, start by designing your element with Square Kicker and then head to your preset tab. If you have an existing design that you've previously created with Square Kicker, you can go straight to this step. When you're designing your element with Square Kicker, you'll notice yellow dots appearing beside your tools that you have used. When creating a preset, all customizations and fields marked with a yellow dot will be included in your preset. Click Create Preset from Current Block Settings and name your new preset. Everything that was previously marked with a yellow dot will now have a purple dot to indicate it has been included in this preset. When you want to apply your preset to another block, open Square Kicker and head to the Preset tab. Presets are specific to each block type, so you will only see the presets you have made for the particular block type you are editing. Select the preset you would like to apply. You can do this by clicking the title or selecting Enable from the drop-down menu. This allows you to craft your own set of unique designs, kind of like creating your very own custom plugin, and then rapidly applying these custom changes across your entire site. If you want to disable your preset, click the title again or select Disable in the drop-down menu. To delete a preset, go to the preset you would like to remove and select Delete from the drop-down menu. Deleting a preset will remove it from the current block as well as all other blocks that you have previously applied it to. You will see this in the confirmation pop-up. After creating a preset, you may want to make additional changes. You can do this by using the edit function. This will immediately apply changes to all your elements across your site that you have previously applied this preset to. Select an element with the preset you want to edit. You cannot edit a preset that is not enabled on the block you are editing. You will see the Square Kicker UI transition. We call it a flippity flip. You'll now see the preset tab is gone and a banner has now appeared telling you that you are editing this preset. You will see your block change as normal, along with any block that has this preset applied. That's because you're changing the design on every block that has this preset applied. When you click Update, Square Kicker will flippity flip back to its original state, immediately updating this preset, and the new settings will be applied to all elements where this preset is enabled. There may be times where you want to make an additional customization, but you only want to apply it to the current block and not to all blocks where the preset is enabled. Simply head to the Design tab in your block and add your customizations. This will override a preset field and you will now see both a purple dot and a yellow dot in the margin, showing you have settings specific to this block and existing preset settings on this field. Block settings always override preset settings as it has a higher priority. If you clear the block settings, the design will revert back to the preset settings. An easy way to remember this rule is that the yellow dot is above the purple dot, telling you that it has a higher priority over the preset. Rather than starting from scratch, you may want to create a new preset based off an existing preset design. You can do this by duplicating your preset and then adding your new styling. You can make multiple presets, all with a small change like the color of a button. Alternatively, you might want to duplicate a preset as a backup if you want to keep experimenting with your designs without having to remember what you've changed. Click Edit in the drop-down. You will see the Square Kicker UI do a flippity flip. You are now editing this preset. Make your new design change or add additional styling to your preset. Click Save As. This will immediately create a new preset. It will not affect the original preset that you started with or any of the blocks that the original preset was applied to. Give this preset a new name to distinguish it from the preset you started with. Another way to create a new preset using an existing preset as a starting point is to use the Duplicate function. Select Duplicate from the drop-down of an existing preset. This will immediately create a new preset with the exact same settings. 
give it a new name to distinguish from the original and continue to edit and make your additional changes. With Square Kicker presets, there has never been a faster and more efficient way of creating custom changes on Squarespace websites. A whole new generation of custom design that will completely change how you design websites on Squarespace. Square Kicker. No code, just design. <laughs>